Good morning, it's uh, January the 3rd, 2012. Uh, you're watching The Big Shave with me, Steve Farragher. Uh, it's back to work day today. Britain gets back to work. We've all had an extra day off, we've had the Monday off. It's Tuesday and a uh, horrible day. You can't hear it actually, but the wind's blowing about 20 30 miles an hour. We've got a gale going on. Um, what we're using today, we're using Ingrams. We've got this from uh, a local, well, um, a, a national discount chemist chain called Superdrug. Uh, it's under two pounds a tube, it's lovely stuff. It's a bit watery when it comes out of the tube, but it's actually. It lathers up really nicely. Uh, we're using the sleeves and the horse hair, so we're trying to get that uh, nice and soft, trying to get the smell off it really. Um, and on the razor end of things, we're, we're still using the the Progress Maker Progress, very heavy razor, short handle. It's the only thing I don't like about it, it's got a short handle. If it was about another inch or two long, it'd be really good. Uh, with a super drug blade in it, super drug on brand blade, which when you open up is a door coat, a uh, Korean door coat. First shave off, it was really good. I've just rotated it and uh, it's fine. So we're back to work today. Um, well, I'll just have a little chat while I'm lather enough. Um, and it's the first, you know, it's the start of the year. We all make resolutions, don't we? So, uh, why do we make resolutions? Anyone any ideas? Because what happens is we tend to break them, don't we? This is the problem with resolutions. We uh, we make them, we break them. And uh, decide not to make any resolutions as a, as a consequence, I suppose. Well, in doing that, I've probably made the resolution, haven't I? I've uh, made the resolution not to make resolutions. Um, because we, we sort of, you know, we, we picked the the start of the year is the time then we're going to give up smoking or we're going to give up certain things and uh, we invariably fail and feel guilty and it, uh, we shouldn't really feel guilty should we really something like that we should just do it maybe we should just do things in the rest of the year not just try and uh, have them at the start okay Yeah, back to work today, back to the uh, full-time job. A bit reluctant, but it uh, pays the bills, doesn't it? Pays for all the shaving gear. Okay, so we're having this, this is on a fire today. It's on the top setting. You've got to be a bit, a bit careful, a bit ginger. You haven't shaved for two days, you see, so I thought it might warrant a fire on the first pass. Going with the growth. Blade's still good. Think about the progress as well, it's got a nice nice size the head, it's very manoeuvrable. Still regrowing the goatee by the way, in case you're wondering. Soapy, minty, mentally smell. I think it's got menthol. Well, it's advertised that menthol on it. Yeah, menthol on the uh, packaging. It's not dead strong, but it's just a, just a hint. It does uh, make the skin feel a bit uh, sparky as well. So, how did everyone's holidays go? Did they have a good time? Have another good New Year's Eve? Got a few issues in our, our streets. We had uh, the um, next door neighbours had a bit of an argument. It was on New Year's Eve. It was on the day after, and uh, <coughs> someone put a plant pot through the front window. So we ended up with uh, the police came round. Uh, a bit of argy bargy. We had a very quiet night in. Uh, the other thing to say is that you know we had a, we had two live stick hams over the holiday period. If you don't know what stick ham is, it's like a live video feed. So we did uh, like a live discussion, and I had a shave as well. We did one on the twenty seventh, 
of December when we did another one uh, on the 1st of January. Uh, quite interesting actually, listening to people, listening to what people say, getting the discussion going. Uh, people seem to enjoy that, so we're going to gonna probably roll out one of them, try and roll out one, one a month. And people there, uh, the opportunity to interact, see how many people we can get on as well. We had, we had about a dozen people all around the world on each, uh, each stick and broadcast. It's an interesting concept, isn't it? People sitting around talking about shaving on a live television channel. Right, nearly finished. This time we're going uh, against. The thing I like about the progress is it's quite a noisy laser. So you do know when, you, when you've solved your beard growth problems. Okay, you're nearly done. It sorts the neck out really well, actually, the, the, uh, the progress. Up the cheeks. The beard's not very long at the moment, the ghosty bone is churned. It's even. Okay, so very sorted, just gotta get this this up off my face. So we want the uh Arco Cologne Arco Action Cologne, which is possibly one of my favourites. It's also between that and cool. Lovely clean shave that. And then uh, Arco Cream. Which is that, in case you haven't seen it. The other thing to say, we're talking on the um, Facebook big shave group about uh, people buying Maker Futures, people are interested in buying Maker Futures. And now the, the, the prices. It's uh, quite difficult to buy a second hand one on Facebook, on uh, YouTube, on, um, on eBay. Less than the price of a brand new one. We did find, I did find a good supply actually for them. And it's called Naked Man. N-A-N-K-D-M-A-N. -N. You find them on there. If you just do a Google. You need them for about 43 quid. Um, post included, free post, so. And you seem to always have them in stock. A lot of the ones who advertise them cheaply. This is the Mercury Future. Don't have them in stock. Okay, so that's the uh, Arco Cream rubbed in. Feels good. I'm going to use the uh, Old Spice White Water. That's the smelly bit. That smells good. It feels good as well. So there you go. We're all finished. Uh, Tuesday the 3rd of January, Big Shave Live from Liverpool, me Steve Farragher. Um, interested to find out about your New Year's resolutions, what you are and what you are doing. As I said, I'm not doing one this year. Resolution is not so often resolution. And um, I'll see you all probably tomorrow or the day after tomorrow. Talk about the girl with the dragon tattoo, away eh? Because I've seen that, it was a good film. And uh, see how my coat is getting on. Okay. Ta folks.